Speakeasy is a numerical computing interactive environment also featuring an interpreted programming language. It was initially developed for internal use at the physics division of Argonne National Laboratory by the theoretical physicist Stanley Cohen. He eventually founded Speakeasy Computing Corporation to make the program available commercially. Speakeasy is a very long-lasting numerical package. In fact, the original version of the environment was built around a core dynamic data repository called Named Storage. Developed in the early 1960s, while the most recent version has been released in 2006. Speakeasy was aimed to make the computational work of the physicists at the Argonne National Laboratory easier. It was initially conceived to work on mainframes, the only kind of computers at that time, and was subsequently ported to new platforms, mini computers, personal computers, as they became available. The porting of the same code on different platforms was made easier by using Mortran metalanguage macros to face systems dependencies and compilers deficiencies and differences. Speakeasy is currently available on several platforms, PCs running Windows, Mac OS, Linux, departmental computers and workstations running several flavors of Linux, X or Solaris. Speakeasy was also among the first interactive numerical computing environments, having been implemented in such a way on a CDC 3600 system, and later on IBM SO machines as one was in beta testing at the Argonne National Laboratory at the time. Almost since the beginning, as the dynamic linking functionality was made available in the operating systems, Speakeasy features the capability of expanding its operational vocabulary using separated modules, dynamically linked to the core processor as they are needed. For that reason such modules were called linkules, linkable modules. They are functions with a generalized interface, which can be written in Fortran or in C. The independence of each of the new modules from the others and from the main processor is of great help in improving the system, especially it was in the old days. This easy way of expanding the functionalities of the main processor was often exploited by the users to develop their own specialized packages. Besides the programs, functions and subroutines the user can write in the speakeasy's own interpreted language, linkules add functionalities carried out with the typical performances of compiled programs. Among the packages developed by the users, one of the most important is Modeli C, originally developed as Fedi C, in the early 1970s at the research department of the Federal Reserve Board of Governors in Washington, D.C. Model EC implements special objects and functions for large econometric models estimation and simulation. Its evolution led eventually to its distribution as an independent product. Topic syntax The symbol, underscore, colon plus underscore, is both the speakeasy logo and the prompt of the interactive session. The dollar sign is used for delimiting comments, the ampersand is used to continue a statement on the following physical line, in which case the prompt becomes, and, colon plus ampersand, a semicolon can separate statements written on the same physical line. Dollar suppose you have a very long statement, dollar you can write it on multiple physical lines using, and, dollar at the end of the line to be continued, underscore the underscore return underscore value equals this underscore is underscore a underscore function underscore with underscore many underscore arguments, argument underscore one, argument underscore two, and, and argument underscore three, argument underscore four, argument underscore five, argument underscore six, dollar on the other hand, you can collect several short statements dollar on a single physical line using underscore a equals 1 b equals 2 c equals 3 d equals 4 as its own name tells speakeasy was aimed to expose a syntax as friendly as possible to the user and as close as possible to the spoken language the best example of that is given by the set of commands for reading and writing data from to the permanent storage 
e.g. the language's keywords are in upper case to clarify the point, underscore get my underscore data from library my underscore project, underscore keep my underscore data as a underscore new underscore name underscore for underscore my data in library other underscore project variables i.e. speakeasy objects are given a name up to 255 character long, when longname option is on, up to 8 characters otherwise for backward compatibility. They are dynamically typed, depending on the value assigned to them. Underscore equals one. Underscore what is a a as a real scalar. Underscore equals now a character array. Underscore what is a a as a twenty one element character array. Arguments of functions are usually not required to be surrounded by parentheses or separated by commas, provided that the context remains clear and unambiguous. For example, underscore sin grid pi 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 thirty two dollar fully specified syntax can be written underscore sin grid pi 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 thirty two dollar the argument of function sin is not surrounded by parenthesis or even underscore sin grid pi 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 thirty two dollar the arguments of function grid can be separated by spaces many other syntax simplifications are possible for example to define an object named a value to a ten elements array of zeros, one can write any of the following statements, underscore equals array 10 to 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, underscore equals 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, underscore equals 0, underscore equals INTS 10, asterisk 0, underscore equals 10, Speakeasy is a vector oriented language, giving a structured argument to a function of a scalar. The result is usually an object with the same structure of the argument, in which each element is the result of the function applied to the corresponding element of the argument. In the example given above, the result of function sin apply to the array let us call it x generated by the function grid as the array answer whose element answer i equals sin x i for each i from 1 to Noel's x the number of elements of x. In other words, the statement underscore equals sin grid pi 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 thirty two is equivalent to the following fragment of program x equals grid pi 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 thirty two dollar generates an array of real numbers from pi to pi, stepping by pi thirty two for i equals one Noel's x dollar loops on the elements of x a i equals sin x i dollar evaluates the ith element of a next i dollar increment the loop index the vector oriented statements avoid writing programs for such loops and are much faster than them. <laughs> <laughs> Work area and objects By the very first statement of the session, the user can define the size of the named storage, or work area, or allocator which is allocated once and for all at the beginning of the session. Within this fixed size work area, the speakeasy processor dynamically creates and destroys the work objects as needed. A user-tunable garbage collection mechanism is provided to maximize the size of the free block in the work area, packing the defined objects in the low end or in the high end of the allocator. At any time, the user can ask about used or remaining space in the work area. Underscore size $100 million Very first statement, the work area will be 100 megabytes. Underscore size dollar returns the size of the work area in the current session. Underscore SPACELEFT dollar returns the amount of data storage space currently unused. Underscore SPACENOW dollar returns the amount of data storage space currently used. Underscore SPACEPEAK dollar returns the maximum amount of data storage space used in the current session. Topic Raw Object Orientation Within reasonable conformity and compatibility constraints, the speakeasy objects can be operated on using the same algebraic syntax. 
From this point of view, and considering the dynamic and structured nature of the data held in the named storage, it is possible to say that Speakeasy since the beginning implemented a very raw form of operator overloading, and a pragmatic approach to some features of what was later called object-oriented programming, although it did not evolve further in that direction. Topic: The object families. Speakeasy provides a bunch of predefined families of data objects, scalars, arrays up to 15 dimensions, matrices, sets, time series. The elemental data can be of kind real, 8 bytes, complex, 2 by 8 bytes, character literal or name literal. Matrices elements can be real or complex. Time series values can only be real. Topic missing values for time series processing. Five types of missing values are provided. They are denoted by NA not available, NC not computable, ND not defined, along with NB and NE the meaning of which is not predetermined and is left available for the Linkules developer. They are internally represented by specific and very small numeric values, acting as codes. All the time series operations take care of the presence of missing values, propagating them appropriately in the results. Depending on a specific setting, missing values can be represented by the above notation, by a question mark symbol, or a blank useful in tables. When used in input, the question mark is interpreted as an NA missing value, underscore B equals time series 1, 2, 3, 4 to 2010 1, 4, underscore BB A time series with four components 1, 2, 3, 4, underscore B 2010 3 equals, underscore Schoenval Q mark, underscore BB A time series with four components 1, 2, 4, underscore 1, B 1, B A time series with four components 1.5.25 underscore Schoenval explain underscore BB a time series with four components 1 2 in a 4 underscore 1 B 1 B a time series with four components 1.5 NC.25 in numerical objects other than time series the concept of missing values is meaningless and the numerical operations on them use the actual numeric values regardless they correspond to missing values codes or not although missing values codes can be input and shown as such underscore one plus one plus equals one point zero zero underscore one one equals five point three zero three three times ten to the thirty six underscore one asterisk one asterisk equals Note that, in other contexts, a question mark may have a different meaning, for example, when used as the first and possibly only character of a command line, it means the request to show more pieces of a long error message which ends with a plus symbol, underscore equals array 10,000, 10,000 smiley face, array 10,000, 10,000 smiley face, in line a equals array 10,000, 10,000 smiley face, too much data, plus, underscore. Allocator size must be at least 859,387 kilobytes, plus, underscore. Use free to remove no longer needed data or use checkpoint to save allocator for later restart, plus, underscore. Use names to see presently defined names. Use size and restore to restart with a larger allocator, underscore. No more information available. Topic logical values Some support is provided for logical values, relational operators the Fortran syntax can be used and logical expressions. Logical values are stored actually as numeric values, with zero meaning false and non-zero one on output meaning true, underscore equals one two three four five, underscore b equals one three two five four, underscore a greater than b a greater than b a five component array o o one o one, underscore a a one one o one o, underscore a eq b a eq b a five component array one o o o 
00 underscore logical 2 dollar this changes the way logical values are shown underscore a greater than b a a greater than b a5 component array fftftftftfaeq b a5 component array tfffff topic programming special objects such as program subroutine and function objects collectively referred to as procedures can be defined for operations automation another way for running several instructions with a single command is to store them into a use file and make the processor read them by mean of the use command topic use files using a use file is the simplest way for performing several instruction with minimal typed input this operation roughly corresponds to what source aim a file is in other scripting languages a use file is an alternate input source to the standard console and can contain all the commands a user can input by the keyboard hence no multi-line flow control construct is allowed. The processor reads and executes use files one line at a time. Use file execution can be concatenated but not nested, i.e. the control does not return to the caller at the completion of the called use file. Topic. Procedures Full programming capability is achieved using procedures. They are actually speakeasy objects, which must be defined in the work area to be executed. An option is available in order to make the procedures being automatically retrieved and loaded from the external storage as they are needed. Procedures can contain any of the execution flow control constructs available in the speakeasy programming language. Topic. Programs A program can be run simply invoking its name or using it as the argument of the command execute. In the latter case, a further argument can identify a label from which the execution will begin. Speakeasy programs differs from the other procedures for being executed at the same scoping level they are referenced to, hence they have full visibility of all the objects defined at that level, and all the objects created during their execution will be left there for subsequent uses. For that reason no argument list is needed. Topic. Subroutines and functions Subroutines and functions are executed at a new scoping level, which is removed when they finish. The communication with the calling scoping level is carried out through the argument list in both directions. This implements data hiding, i.e. objects created within a subroutine or a function are not visible to other subroutine and functions but through argument lists. A global level is available for storing object which must be visible from within any procedure, e.g. the procedures themselves. The functions differ from the subroutines because they also return a functional value, reference to them can be part of more complex statement and are replaced by the returned functional value when evaluating the statement. In some extent, speakeasy subroutines and functions are very similar to the Fortran procedures of the same name. Topic. Flow control An if-then-else construct is available for conditional execution and two forms of for-next construct are provided for looping. A go-to-label statement is provided for jumping, while a Fortran-like computed go-to statement can be used for multiple branching. An on-error mechanism, with several options, provides a means for error handling. Topic. Linkule writing 
Linkules are functions usually written in Fortran or, unsupportedly, in C. With the aid of Mortran or C macros and an API library, they can interface the speakeasy work area for retrieving, defining, manipulating any speakeasy object. Most of the speakeasy operational vocabulary is implemented via linkules. They can be statically linked to the core engine, or dynamically loaded as they are needed, provided they are properly compiled as shared objects Unix or DLL Windows. Topic external links The Spikasi Computing Corporation website. The Spikasi Computing Corporation's channel on YouTube The Econometric Modeling and Computing Corporation website. An interesting conversation with Stan Cohen. Topic. Notes <laughs>